Here's your 41 Now update, sponsored by Kansas City Regional Association of Realtors. I'm Krista Dubill with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines for this Tuesday, September 25th. One person is dead after crashing his motorcycle into a school bus in KCK. That motorcyclist, who was a man in his 20s, was killed. None of the kids on the bus was physically hurt. The school bus was taking nine kids to KCK Early Childhood Education Center. They were transferred to another bus. Tonight, Raytown leaders will decide if they'll transfer the city's EMS services over to the fire department. Supporters say it'll help with staffing and decrease response times. The move could mean more ambulances at multiple locations. But critics say there's not enough information and they're concerned about job loss. If aldermen approve the transfer, it will go into effect in November. Raytown voters will then decide next year on a $450,000 levy for the change. You can now register to vote at your local library. All Kansas City Library locations will help you register for free any day they are open. You need to bring either a driver's license, passport, school ID, utility bill, or bank statement. The deadline is October 10th to be able to vote in the November election. Your forecast is next. Did you know not all real estate agents are the same? Look for the Realtor logo to be certain you have a qualified advocate on your side. Visit KCRAR.com for more information. All right, here is your forecast by morning down to 45 degrees. That's right. You can open up the windows. It might be a little chilly by morning indoors. And then in the afternoon tomorrow, about 67 for the high. A great fall day. Seven day forecast shows another warm up heading this way. 70s by Thursday and Friday. Clouds move in Friday night. Maybe some rain or thunderstorm Saturday with another front. So and then look at that back up into the 80s. So there is your forecast. Remember, you can get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com. Look around our streets, our communities, our children. Now more than ever, we need the crime. We need the violence to stop. At 41 Action News, we say enough is enough. That's why we're taking action with Safe KC. Not just reporting the problems, but showing solutions with stories of hope, stories with answers. Because violence knows no race, no city, no zip code. Watch Safe KC only on 41 Action News and KSHB.com.